Hey everybody, welcome to a new edition of Gear We Test. Today, we're gonna check out what's in this box, the Circle V. Okay, so we want to know what this shoe is all about and what Van set out to accomplish with it. It was really an effort by the company to make something with sustainable goals in mind, which meant tapping into ways to use renewable materials and reducing waste in their production process. They're stressing that every little bit helps when it comes to sustainability, so they applied that thinking into many of the details we as consumers might not always consider when buying shoes. And you're probably asking, what might that be? Okay, first off, the upper is made of 48% organic cotton, 47% hemp, and 5% nylon. But when the package arrived at my home and I learned these were hemp shoes, I wasn't sure what to think, wasn't sure how comfortable that sounded. I imagined a stiff slip-on, but these are actually surprisingly comfortable, and that cotton, hemp, nylon blend is definitely softer and more stretchy than your typical canvas sneakers, for example. Bonus points here because they're also pretty breathable, so you can rock them without socks comfortably, which makes them a solid option for, say, pre- and post-surf slip-ons, something you can cruise around the beach with pretty easily. And remember, I said they focused on the sustainable details with these. The shoelaces are made of 100% jute. If you've never seen or heard of jute, it's a plant-derived fiber that is favored in some areas of the world because it's fairly easy to grow, requiring little water or fertilizer. Uh, these feature the Eco Kush insole. Looks like cork. These are 70% bio-based Fates foam, which feels really rubbery and makes for a good, comfortable cushion with even better support than your typical Vans classics, in my opinion. Uh, they went with the Vans gum look for their Eco Waffle outsole, which is made from responsibly sourced natural rubber rather than a petroleum-derived synthetic compound because, again, every little bit helps. 